And now an update to a case we have been following closely for some time, the case of Bradley Manning. A military judge has accepted the terms of Manning's plea, which was submitted earlier this month, where he would plead guilty to some charges of sending classified materials to WikiLeaks. Uh, the judge has not formally accepted the plea, but has approved the language of the offenses Manning would admit to. Now, those charges would carry a maximum prison sentence of 16 years. Well, just moments ago, the private first class took to the stand for the first time in his pre-trial hearing in Fort Meade. Appearing nervous, Manning answered questions about his arrest in Baghdad in 2010 and the ensuing treatment he received while in detention. While in court, lawyers for the defense drew up life-sized outlines of his cell in Quantico. Manning reportedly walked around the outline describing the different aspects of his cell while donning a bulky suicide smock he was made to wear. Well, Manning's defense team argues that the charges against the Army private should be dropped completely. They say he was punished enough while he was in Conoco. They allege harsh and torturous conditions while locked up in solitary confinement, including forced sleep deprivation and forced nudity. It's unclear whether uh, prosecutors will continue to pursue other counts, the most serious of which is aiding the enemy. If convicted of that charge, Manning could be looking at life behind bars. We'll keep you posted on the latest on this case as it develops.